And yes, now it is time to check your money with America's Money Maven, Vicki Brackens. Vicki Brackens is the president of Brackens Financial Solutions Network, LLC, and a registered representative of LPL Financial, member SIPC. Vicki. Well, hey, George. How are you this morning? I'm doing good, Vicki. How are you? I'm doing great. Listen, um, I was listening to a couple of things that you were saying earlier. Yes. And you know that today we're talking about preparation being the key to success. Yes. So I want everyone to understand yes. that if they are not listening to me today, uh -huh. they will be in deep trouble next week because oh. they will not be prepared for something that's really, really important. Well, we need to get prepared. So here it is. Okay. Today, what's the date today? Today is February the 7th. Today is February the, the 9th. Oh, I'm about to say, George, <laughs> I was feeling really bad. I had written it down. Okay, but today well, first of all, is well, the Did you night. dig out okay after all the snow this week? Oh, my God. I sent my friends down in Georgia and, and Tennessee and so forth some videos of us driving down the road in the snow, and they wrote back things like, well, I can't repeat the things what they, they said. wrote. Basically, I was trying to get them up here for the concert next week. Right. I don't think that's going to happen. It's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. But anyway, today is Sunday, February 9th. Uh-huh. And next Friday, what is next Friday, George? Next Friday is Valentine's Day. Next Friday is Valentine's Fellas, Day. I'm just letting y'all know. Okay, so and let me say something. Sisters, too. Y'all exactly. y'all need to put, y'all need to do a little something, too, y'all. This yo. is for everyone. Right. Next Friday is yeah. Valentine's Day. Okay. Be prepared. Okay. Go out, buy the card today. All right. Go ahead, For real. Yeah. Go ahead and order the candy, set up the dinner, all the things that you do. Do what you got to do. Because I am declaring next Friday, Valentine's Day, listen to me carefully, debt free Valentine's. That's interesting. Now, you, you after we spend all the money on the roses and the candy no, and the flowers. You wait till I, I give you the uh, instructions. Okay, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> I'm going to give you the instructions. Yes. It's extremely important. Yes. Debt free because we've spent already four weeks this year mm -hmm. preparing your debt structure, yeah. yes, right. looking at what you already owe, mm -hmm. getting an idea of, of what types of things we need to do to reduce debt. I don't want you to go out and blow those four weeks of work mm -hmm. because all of a sudden you run up another credit card bill. Right. So this is going to be debt free Valentine's, Valentine's Day. Day cash only. only. I love that. Cash only. All right, all right, so then you got to leave Amazon alone then. Yes, you do. <laughs> <laughs> unless you've unless you got a debit card. I consider right. a debit card cash. Oh, okay. Debit okay, card Okay, so only. a debit card means it's cash coming down you, but do not charge it. No charge it. No charge it. Because you know what I found out? What you found out? I think I talk about this every year, but if we look back on 2019 mm -hmm. and, and what's predicted for 2020, mm -hmm. this year it is predicted that we are going to spend, listen to this, $27.4 billion, $27.4 billion on Valentine's Day. Mm. One day. Do you know what that equates to? No. About a 32% increase from last year, which was around $20 billion. Mm -hmm. It equates to, give, I'll, give you, I'll give you an idea. The, the Onondaga County budget right. for 2019 was $1 billion. One. One billion. Okay. The entire one billion three hundred and twenty two million, mm -hmm. in case somebody wants to look it up. Right. The entire budget for the state of New York was one hundred and seventy five billion. So what that really means is, George, is that we're spending about 15 percent of the entire budget for the state of New York for everything that happens on Valentine's Day. On the Valentine's Day. That doesn't quite sound that right. That makes no sense, huh? Okay, so here's the deal. What's the deal, Vicki? We want to make sure that we are or we are staying in cash. We're not creating an additional debt for Valentine's Day. Think about when you were young. Mm -hmm. Get a little creative. Think about the things that you did when, when life was young and love was young. We still felt great about it, right? But we didn't have the cash to spend or the, the debt availability that we had, and we still said I love you in some very impactful ways. So my sweetheart and I got together, and we said we're going to put a list together of the things that we did okay. when we were young and see if they can spur some ideas for some other people. Okay. So here's one of the well, things. Well, first of all, yeah. before, you, before you continue, though, you got to get the sisters on board with this. Oh, this is, well, because sisters, this, listen to me. Because they want what they want on that deck. Okay. So here's, here's the way I'm, All going, right, get to, I'm going to Sisters, are y'all listening? First, because first obligation. Yeah. Everybody agree. Okay. Debt-free Valentine's All Day. Right. All right. Everybody agree. K 
cash is the way that we're going to do this. Okay. Everybody agree that we understand that we're trying to accomplish more than a one-day event. One of the things that I've noticed, I'm glad you, you brought this up, right. is that many times we're spending money on Valentine's Day or gifts and things of that nature because we're trying to make up for mm. some time or experience that we didn't spend together so this is our way of making up for it. Okay. And so we get really caught up in the guilt portion of it uh -huh. and spend more than we need to. I am just as guilty as anybody else, so I have to check I, myself. I have a different take on that. Okay. I think, we, I think we're fulfilling the expectations of our partner who expects us to do what everybody else is doing, that there needs to be flowers on the job or in the somewhere. <laughs> like, in other words... It's not that we are feeling guilty. I mean, I, and a, in, in, in addition yeah, okay. to, in okay. addition to, okay. but I also feel like it's out of that, I better do something kind right. of thing. Right, okay, but here's the, I better do something. Let's do more throughout the year. Right, and how about we agree, what, what's our thing? Debt-free Valentine's Debt Day. Debt-free right. Valentine's let's Day. Let's go. So what, what are we going to do instead? Here's, here's some things that I said we can do throughout the year okay. to mitigate the feeling of, that I got to do everything on this day. On this day right. Okay. Like, when we were young, we used to read books to each other. Now, I know some people are going like, what do you mean read books to each other? But I would read a chapter, and Erlene would read a chapter. That's we'd, cute. We would grab a book that we wanted to read, but most of us don't have the time or the willpower these days to sit down alone right. and read a book, but we had an obligation. Did you read it out loud? Or out loud. Oh, oh, so oh, that's cute. Yeah. Okay. okay. She'd read a chapter. I'd read a chapter All right. until we finished the book. Then we grab another book. Another one, take long walks together. Now, I know JT's going to love this. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> okay, I got to get back to the long walks right, portion. Right, right, right. But if, it, you know, it's the middle of winter, so right. okay. Now, here, I love your next one. Oh, what's that? after the long walk and getting fit, then what we going to do? We're going to play some cards. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, I, but I saw cakes, cookies. Oh, you saw the cakes <laughs> and cookies. You went down too far. I did, I did, I did, I <laughs> did. But okay. okay, we're going to play some cards. We're going to play some cards together. Card games that don't require money. Okay. No poker. Mm -hmm. Okay. Card uh, and bid whist or bid whist spades or whatever. Exactly. What else do people play? Um, um I don't know. black folk. We, we, <laughs> <laughs> we play bid whist and spades. Yeah, I guess there's other games. <laughs> I don't know what else. Go I fish. <laughs> Go fish. Okay. I guess. Okay. Oh no. Uno. Right. Okay. You know. We're getting to Uno. We, that, we've done that as a family. Okay. So one of the things I said was also pull out some of those old board games that you've got in the back of the closet right. and play games with your kids. Okay. They have not seen a board game. Right. Believe it or not, they'd be fascinated if they, right. if they asked to do that. Right. I'm going to run through the, the last one. So I did say bake together. Bake together. Cakes and cookies and things of that That's nature. That's cute. Okay. So that you have. You don't have to eat them. You can just give them Give them away. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> give them away. Okay. Revisit the places and activities that you did together when you were young. Right. Okay. I used we used to like to go sit out at the lake. Right. Or do some things of that you nature. Can do some of those oh, okay. Yeah, All right then. We're good. All right then. And then um, also make sure that you have time to what I call meditate together. Oh, uh, okay. Just basic quiet time. Okay? okay. So get a giant puzzle. Oh. That would drive me crazy. Get a giant puzzle. Find a a, a, a a place in your house where you can come and sit for, you know, 30 minutes, an hour together. But also leave it open so if somebody figures out a piece, they can add to the piece, okay? Yeah. And once the puzzle is completed, go ahead and shellac it, mm -hmm. mount it, okay, and, and start, a, start a puzzle uh, menagerie in your okay. house. Okay. So and my favorite, now I know everybody's going to laugh about this, but this is my favorite, George. Right. A big box, that big 64 box mm -hmm. of Crayolas, right. crayons, Do get a coloring and a big giant coloring book is something that will, would make my heart sing. Be all right. Because we used to sit you down. You hear that early and get that coloring yeah, book Yeah, she out. knows that. All okay? right, all right. Okay, uh, we would sit down and color together, but I would spend most of the time coloring because I love that. You know what we used that. to do with the coloring books? My, my dear godmother, Valley, she would make all the coloring characters brown and okay. outline them in black. Isn't that cute? Oh. Well, I'm going to do that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm absolutely going to do that. So anyway, I want to hear more ideas. Okay. So on on the Facebook page, yes. Let's let's hear from everybody their ideas of things that they could do to create a debt free, free. cash only Valentine's okay. Day okay. and activities that we can do together so that we are we are preparing for this as we get ready for 2021. We'll, have that list. we'll give them your suggestions online as well. Yes, okay, that and would be great. And then they'll add to the and list. And they add to the list. Okay. All right, just in case anybody doesn't know, 
February 23rd, where are we going? We're going to the Syracuse Downtown Marriott. Syracuse Downtown Marriott. Gerald Veasley and Jasmine Gent. That's correct. It is the uh, CMY Jazz House Foundation Black History Month Cabaret, February 23rd. Doors open at 4. Doors open at 4. And, and the performance starts at 5. 5. And, and I expect, based on some of the comments that I'm starting to get, that we are going to be there maybe a little bit longer than our regular time. Listen. Because everybody's getting ready for a party. And uh, I hope... I, I hope there's some food I can eat there. Though. Oh, there's going to be plenty of food, okay, which, again, we've got a, a very generous sponsor, okay, and Bill and Nancy Byrne, who are covering yes. our food okay, concession, or not even concession, our food for the evening. Right. So look forward to seeing you all there. If you have any questions, though, remember, if you have any financial questions, reach out to me at info at brackensfsn.com. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. That's info at brackens fsn.com or look for us on YouTube or like us on our Facebook page. And George, I'll say at this point in time, our plate is full. All right. Thank you very much, Vicki, for the tips on a debt-free Valentine's Day. And we should tell you that Vicki Brackens is the sponsor of our money segment. Vicki Brackens is the president of Brackens Financial Solutions Network, LLC, and the registered representative of LPL Financial, member SIPC.